Scott. I don't think the American people have been uh, properly informed about what uh, is at stake and what American interests are in Kosovo. I think the President needs to make that clear. I think that Congress needs to be involved in that discussion, maybe have some debate. I have been advocating for months uh, that, the, that NATO take strong action to stop uh, the deaths of people in Kosovo. The last time I had a conversation with him was August the 20th, when he basically uh, asked for my support of the bombing. <laughs> I think we've got to try to get this diplomatic solution. I certainly hope for it. I think it's possible to do that. If as part of that, uh, NATO has to do some more peacekeeping as we're now doing in Bosnia, I think that's something we ought to seriously entertain. Uh, what we've done in Bosnia has worked. We haven't gotten the people out quickly, but we've drawn down the number of people we have there. The violence has stopped, and I think we've created a climate in the country where long-standing peace can occur. And if we can do that in Kosovo and defuse that second situation in this very troubled part of the world, that would be a good thing to do. Thank, Thank you. you.